Hello friends, I just don't want to make some words in the beginning of this video, just I want to tell you what this video will be about a trip into Bashkortostan Republic of Russia. So I think this trip will be very fascinating for us, because in, even in the beginning of this video I feel the real vibe of Bashkortostan Republic. Now we are in Kandri and it's very awesome let's see here. So let's ride with us. Let's go into the Bashkortostan Republic. Don't ever go to check my bush. So I fell in love in Bashkortostan. In this video, we will travel into the western part of Bashkortostan Republic. Uh, we will travel around the cities like uh, Bilibi, Devlikanova, Tuimazi, and Oktoberski. So, we will explore the Bugulmina Bilibevska Plateau. And this place, first of all, known about the uh, oil, how to name oil, I don't know where exactly the, the verb, how to explain this. But here is making oil from the fossil fuels, from the land. So, but except this, here is absolutely astonishing landscapes. So look at this. Absolutely astonishing place. Now we came. Today is our first day. And we just we just only came from the cousin. We will we was going approximately uh, six hours by car and just came here to to enjoy the absolutely nice sunset. So Enjoy it too with us. Good morning friends, we just was having a good night at the tents and it was very very cool night, honestly. I didn't know what's even in the middle of June, almost might be weather like this, so it's very cold even for European parts of Russia, very cold weather. Today, today will be approximately plus 15 degrees and it's only so Let's go check, check out what's going outside of a tent. Good morning, Askar. Do you have any emotions about this night? Да, было здорово, было очень душевно. Еда была вкусная, компания была хорошая. Для этого и стоит отдыхать на природе. What do you think about the weather at night? 
было холодно, к сожалению. А так в целом палатка тепло. Ни на что жаловаться не приходится. We stopped on the night on the coast of Kandarikul Lake. And Kandarikul Lake is the second largest lake of Bashkortostan Republic. Um, and we, we are planning to continue our route to explore local destinations of Bugulmina Bilibevska Plato. And we stopped here just not for getting the sun bath on the coast, on the beach. We stopped here just only for a night. Uh, but honestly, I see you what water temperature in the lake uh so warmer if in comparison with air temperature <laughs> what surprised me during the road here it's absolutely nice green color uh everything outside the car was fresh green color so it's looking very awesome in the beginning of summer and it's looking like a may gonna be continue so flowers are blooming uh trees are making green and more green and absolutely unsustainable weather. Hopefully, it gives us very interesting landscapes. happiness and also peace for everyone. Generally our trip going through the steppe landscapes, through steppe natural area and generally steps are going in Bashkortostan only in western part and maybe in southern parts of it because on the west or eastern part of Bashkortostan uh, beginning Ural Mountains and I'm full of love uh, of uh, steppe because of it's my favorite natural area in Russia and also step looking better when it's going through the hills, through the ravines maybe in general through the uneven surfaces and when it's going through a straight line of step maybe in, maybe in Volgograd region or Rostov region so it's looking boring but here in Bashkortostan it's looking astonishing and one feature of making landscapes uh, more astonishing it's uh, weather so weather making uh, landscapes better because of uh, it's making more epic and and also the best weather for uh, travel for the for the step is cloudy weather well, like here right now Just, just look at this. Now it's 
June, man. June and it is all flowers are blooming. So it's very, very good time for visiting step landscapes also. So absolutely powerful landscape here. So let's go. Let's let's continue our climbing on Jesus Capital. Friends, now is very important message. So one of my favorite wishes to realize with culture about preservation of natural areas. And I want the Russians take care about nature. Don't do like this. Don't do like this going by, by car on the hill. Because when you're going by car on the grass, it's destroying it. Because here is a lot of rare plants living. Let's save nature together. Ну тут как минимум около 10 краснокнижных видов Республики Башкорстан и несколько видов из красных книг России. В частности, вот люцерна, сетчатоплодная из красных книг России. Он копеечник крупноцветковый сидит тоже из красных книг России. Соответственно, и Башкирии тоже. Ну и ге как геоморфологический памятник природы интересен. Интересный живописный эрозионный, а эрозионный останется. Как появился, как появилась вот эта гора? Ну, гору сделал река Дема. Когда-то были осадочные породы, вот река блуждала везде и вымывала. И вот кусок какого-то мыса, вот коренного берега, видите, вот коренной берег идет, плата. И вот участки коренного берега остались вы, вырезанные. Ну, ручьи, естественно, тоже играли роль. Это чисто резионного происхождения. Вот эти останцы. Вот гора Сатертау тоже памятник природы. Они близнецы, по флоре они одинаковые практически. То есть это самая-самая твердая порода здесь сохранилась, а остальное все вымылось рекой. Ну там тоже твердая порода была, это просто игра природы. Ну вот видите, вот большой роль, что гора не рассыпалась, вот песчаник и плиты имеет. Они твердые. А во всякие мерги или глины, пески они осыпаются. Bugulmina Bilibevska played a rich not only beautiful landscapes, but it also rich on the fossil fuels, especially of oil. And beside me you can see a uh, special construction for extracting of oil. Uh, honestly, a local oil not so good as maybe shelf oil, but so it's because of it uh, requires a lot of uh, processing. Local villages are looking not good as it may be just in 50 kilometers only in neighboring Tatarstan. Bashkortostan population is 4 million people, 2 million of Bashkirs, 1 million of Russian and 1 million of Tatars. In village live old people mainly, and their quality of life depends on adult children who earn money in big cities. Not rarely when people ruin themselves by drink. Снимаем, покажем, что красота. Пая. Она красота. Красота или она для... да? Для памяти, чтобы потом показывать детям своим. Эй. Чтобы потом, чтобы люди потом увидели. Обманчика и обманчика. Обманчика. Итман. Обманчика. Эби, беби. Беби. Бола, бола, манди. Беби. Эй, беби, манди. Это кое мне так сказать? Откуда появился отсюда? Казан, да, Казан, Казан, да. Казан, да? Казан, Казан. Sorry, can you tell me, can I find here Midavuha? So, I think it's mean not. 
so friends I'm really devastated we didn't find here midavuha at all here is no midavuha here is no honey that's why here is no midavuha Midavut in Russian honey and here is no beekeeping in western part of Bashkortostan uh, mostly beekeeping in west in eastern part of Bashkortostan in where is where is beginning Ural Mountains but here is no Midavuha because of here is no honey so what a pity for us maybe next time we will find Good morning friends, today is our last day of our trip and now we are climbing up on the last uh, mount on our trip, Mount Satyr Tau. Satyr very similar with Russian Shatyor, which means in English maybe like a tent. Um, and just we are here, I want to show the plants what I know it's exactly, because of here is a lot of different species of uh, plants, but I know exactly only two of these, so this is Salvia absolutely fascinating flower it's no borders of blooming here it's everywhere everywhere is blooming salvia here and one of the most typical plants for the steppe is fever grass or russian kavil so very awesome plant i think look at this just only look at this <laughs> When we were climbing by slope, we saw not only interesting plants actually, but also some animals, green toad and sand lizard. The view from Satur Tau excited me moreover. Now we are heading to Aslikul Lake, 
and Asli Kul translated like uh, uh, Kul in general from Turkish languages like a lake, Asli from Bashkir language like uh, uh, bitter. Why this lake is bitter? Because of uh, water in this lake is a little bit salty. So we headed here for swimming, but honestly, I don't think we will swim today because of it's absolutely, absolutely, but so so cold weather and very very windy, so not comfortable weather for swimming actually. And uh, we we thought that we'll go here for and we swim because of only in the last day uh, of the trip of the trip uh, it would be um, good weather for swimming. So actually we came here and we and it doesn't happen. But you may enjoy also the best sceneries of Aslekul Lake. Generally, Bugulmina Beribevska Plateau is a part of East European Plain, but in Bashkortostan begins begins uh, Ural Mountains. So I think I told you it's about approximately third time during video, and the first sign of uh, beginning of uh, mountains, uh, hills, and one on our side. I think you you already hear it. It's a waterfall. We came to a waterfall of Sharlama. Let's check it. Sharlama waterfalls, not Niagara Falls or Victoria waterfall, but so for Bugulmina Belibevska Plateau, it's so good waterfall, absolutely wild vibe here. What a aggressive man! What a aggressive man! Look, just real dinosaur, absolutely real dinosaur of. Russian steps, awesome. But fe female, so, so female is so cute. She's so she's she's cunt. But male, absolutely aggressive. Absolutely. Uh, oh, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Stop biting me, man! Man, stop biting! Stop! <laughs> so it's painful for me, and I think it's absolutely painful for for him. So let's free them. <laughs> we free them. Do you want to take another photo? <laughs> <laughs> the, mo the most common biota for them is the uh, sovereign exposition of hills. So let's free them. You're going to be free also. What an aggressive man. Really, really aggressive man. <laughs> so, last time we are seen together. You can be free, man. Oh, don't, don't bite her! Be free also. Every trip is sometimes ending, and now we have to go the long way to our home, to Kazan.
Sometimes Russian roads go in closer to absolutely awesome places. But at the same time, Russian roads, it's not a paradise. <laughs> so look at this absolutely disgusting roads. So these roads are frequently you can you can meet it uh, when you're going from one uh, center of district of Bashkorostan to another center of district of Bashkorostan. So uh, more safety, I think, going by our own foot. Additionally, I think the most dangerous roads in Bashkorostan in Chekmagush. Don't ever go to Chekmagush. The last one destination of our trip will be just the usual Soviet signboard between Muslimova and Bakali of Tatarstan and Bashkortostan. So, looking awesome. Thank you, Bashkortostan. Башкирия вода, 40 градусов она. Если выпьешь той воды, то пойдешь считать столбы. А я выпил той воды и пошел считать столбы. 48 насчитал, в отрезвитель я попал. А в отрезвители уют, за богом ебало бьют. Раз побьют и два побьют. И на кладбище везут, а на кладбище уют, Бля, ебанис, вот в крестик и суют, Раз суют и два суют, И на кладбище везут, А на кладбище уют, Бля, я плевал, вот в крестик и суют, Раз суют и два суют, Побухают и уйдут. О, -о Башкирия, это вам не Сирия, Это вам Башкирия, Мамагонный рай. О, Башкирия, это вам не Сирия, Это вам Башкирия, Мамагонный край.